Oh, welcome back, you beauties. Time to have a little bit of fun. Joining us right now is Matthew Fields. We know him oh so well, and we love this guy. The front man of Beatenburg, Cape Town's, I think, greatest musical export. And he's here to enjoy his day off with us. So can we give the man a round of applause? Matthew Fields! Pew, 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 pew. Good to see you, buddy. Yeah, good to see, good you, to too. see you, man. Good to see you guys, too. Thank yeah. you for coming out on a public holiday. For sure. I know you wanted to chill today. Maybe I didn't. But you always kind of chill. <laughs> he is always kind of chill. I feel chilled, like yeah. you're okay in yeah. any sort of environment, man. Oh, this is good. Yeah. How's London? It's cool. It's um, <clears throat> I've actually been here for a while, so I've, I'm starting to forget what, what it's like. Because I've been here since the beginning of the year. Okay. Yeah. So, wow, I haven't heard from Matthew since the mm. beginning of the year. This is unique, though. I see. So, have you been sort of incubating a project? Is that why? Yeah, I've been working a lot on a solo project as well. Ah. Um, and then there's been various things with band stuff to do as well. Yeah, so I've been pretty busy. Yeah. What was the time like in London, plugging yeah. yourself into that kind of ecosystem? I know you guys were primed mm. at that point to take it to the next level. Mm. When you got there and you got to actually live in that space, mm. how has that kind of shifted the journey? Um, well, it's been it's been a creative sort of freeing time for me I think like Brilliant. you know after the whole yeah. COVID thing and everything I started doing some solo work as well and moving to London was also part of that and working with um, my managers who man, manager who's there and um, just meeting loads of new people and opening up different opportunities it's, yeah it's been really cool, been really cool. Lovely. Time has yeah. come. I love it yeah, yeah, you guys are on fire, honestly. Thanks. <laughs> so, I mean, I'll again. Uh, the name is called The Great Fire of oh. Beatenburg. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't even know that. that was oh, yeah, yeah, that's yeah. very natural. Right. But you're yeah. working on that yeah. album and then offering... Beatenburg have always had an iconic sound, and you still do, mm. is, you know, paying homage to that sound that you have from Beatenburg in this new album, and also mm. offering something a bit fresh. You know, give me the art direction, just so we yeah. know what we can expect. Because I've heard yeah. a song called Worth More. Oh, yeah, which thank is you. absolutely incredible. Was it? Yeah. Thank we you. want Thanks so much. Yeah. So what's this album about and the direction of it? Um, yeah, well, I guess that was part of the intention was to to reconnect with, I guess, the roots of our sound and to um, bring something to people who've, who've known us since our first album and yeah. sort of like, you know, yeah, the idea was to, to reach people and to um, find the sort of magic of what, what, like, what makes us who we are, yeah. um, sonically and musically. Um, yeah, so I think there's a mix of things like some songs that are sort of slower a bit more introspective and then there's some more up-tempo things like just as as you would expect from a from mm -hmm. a full album i guess um yeah it's a, like we're, we're proud of the work that we've done yeah why was it so important for you to reconnect to that spirit did, did you yeah, guys I, feel I, like you had you had kind of drifted away from mm -hmm. your true north because it feels like there's yeah. a lot of intention behind what you're doing why why steep yourself back in that Beatenberg sound and kind of come hard in that space? Was there a, a particular phase in your own journey? Why kind of take this approach? Yeah, I think um, there is, I've been thinking recently about the, the fact of living in another country and, and as a person you can adjust to it and all these things and, you know, I have a connection to South Africa and I've, I've got things going on in London as well and it's all manageable in a way. But I think the band actually it occurred to me that the band moving as a band, like, as an organism, is kind of like it struggles in a way to, yeah. to be cut off from its roots. Because yeah. we did grow up here and we started making our music here. And also importantly, the first sort of connection that we had with, with people who liked our music happened here and in some, a way that we didn't expect. Sorry. And some so. die hard fans. Yeah. And I love that about the South African yeah. fan base. You will yeah. see the same 300 people <laughs> in the front yeah. row every single time you perform, <laughs> which is quite a special thing. Yeah, we really appreciate, we really appreciate that. Um, and I guess, um, yeah, so, so having sort of felt like we're, we've all been living in different parts of the world. And I think that's where the reconnection comes in, where it's, it's sort of like as people, we can manage it, but as a band, we wanted to make an effort to sort of just come come back. I Get guess. that connection. Yeah, it's great. Yeah. Strong again. We love the sound yeah. of that, yeah. man. It's, it's fantastic. And I know people are, are waiting. I know some people rename themselves the Chelsea Blakemore. People have moved <laughs> to the southern <laughs> suburbs because of you guys. Oh, really? But we remember you. And that's why, yeah. Matthew Field, we'd love to see you. I watched a poll. I, I think didn't Chelsea. Miss that one, by the way. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I think Chelsea's one of the most popular names in London right now. So, dude, I think you might have right. might have hit on something. Buddy, yeah. we cannot wait <laughs> to hear you. Yeah. Uh, your royalties are in the, in the mail. We yeah. cannot wait to hear you perform. 
for, my friend. The Thank soundtracks you. have been amazing. So we're going to send you off yes. into oh. your happy place. Thank you. Thanks for having me. Oh, man, we love this guy and we love what he represents. And it makes, it makes my heart warm to know that they pay so much respect to yeah. the connection they have with their South African fan base. And we always want to see our artists going global, becoming international superstars, mm. especially with our sound being so hot right now. Yeah. Um, but we want to know that the fans in South Africa still get their just rewards. And we're going to get that right now as Matthew takes us through a beautiful performance on your Human Rights Day. Um, hi, my name is Matthew and this is a song called When I Fall Asleep. Lofty language will not be here telling you nothing, digging my grave when I fall asleep, when I fall. Oh, 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 oh,